Driving in winter conditions is hazardous, so it's good to be prepared. Fundamental advice is things like clearing your car of snow and ice so you can see properly, ensuring that your tires and your battery are in good shape, even carrying along some kitty litter in case you get stuck. However, we at Chevy have some other tips that we think you might not know that will go a long way to ensure that you have a happy and safe winter driving season. First thing is, get comfortable. The problem is this bulky jacket and the thick gloves. The jacket impedes my arm movements, which could be a problem in an emergency maneuver, and the gloves, well, they mute my sense of steering feel, and they don't make the controls easy to use. So, the answer, get rid of them. That's better. Which brings us to our second tip, which also concerns wardrobe, those huge snow boots. The thick sole means you can't really feel the pedals, and you might mash two pedals at once. Our suggestion? leave a pair of more appropriate footwear in the car. Something else to think about, turn down the heat. It's cold outside, but if it's too hot inside the car, you may become drowsy. And this is a time when you really need to be very focused. Our fourth tip, be aware of the outside temperature. Anything below 32 degrees is dangerous, but the worst range is actually between 24 degrees and 34 degrees. Other traffic on the road causes the ice or snow to melt just a little bit. And that melted ice, that wet ice, is more slippery than ice or snow that's frozen solid. Our fifth tip, be aware just how much wintry conditions affect traction. Snow has 50% less traction than a dry road, and ice offers 75% less traction. So slow it down, brake early, just be gentle around the corners, take everything easy. Bonus tip. The easiest way to stay safe in a winter storm is simply to stay off the roads. If you can, kick back by the fire. Driving in winter conditions is hazardous, so it's best to be prepared as you can. Fundamental advice are things like clear off your vehicle of snow and ice so you can see properly, ensure that your batteries and your tires are in good shape, and even maybe bring along some kitty litter in case you get stuck. However, we've also got some advice of things you might not know that we think will go a long way to help ensure a happy and safe winter driving season. Our first tip is lose the big bulky jacket and the thick gloves. A jacket like this impedes your arm movements and makes it difficult if you have to make an emergency maneuver. The gloves actually lessen your feeling on the steering wheel and they're also hard to use the controls. So our suggestion is take them all off. Our second piece of advice involves footwear. The big snow boots, lose them. Unfortunately, you can't really feel the gas or the brake pedal, and you may mash both pedals at the same time. So bring along a spare pair of sneakers. Something else to think about, turn down the heat. Yeah, it's cold outside, but if it's too hot inside the car, you may become drowsy. And this is a time when you really need to be very focused. Another tip, be aware of the outside temperature. We all know that anything below 32 degrees is dangerous. However, the worst range is between 24 degrees and 34 degrees if there's snow or ice on the road. Other traffic causes melting, making it much more dangerous. Something else to consider is how much of winter conditions affect traction. Snow gives 50% less traction than a dry road and ice 75% less traction than a dry road. The takeaway, slow down, use your brakes and be very careful out there. 